Hi, Esther here from Life Science Centre, and believe it or not, I am holding a poo. This isn't just any poo though, it's a dinosaur poo. It doesn't smell, and it isn't squishy, although it probably was when it was fresh, but it's been turned into a fossil over millions of years. Cutting it open could tell us about what the dinosaur ate. If it was full of bits of plants, it would have come from a herbivore, and if it was full of fragments of bone, it would have been pooed out by a meat-eating carnivore. But droppings weren't the only things that dinosaurs left behind. Sometimes their footprints were covered up and survived long enough for us to discover them. Dinosaurs' footprints changed depending on whether they were running or walking, and so can yours. Try setting up a start line and then running 10 paces from it and marking how far you got. Then go back to the start and walk for 10 paces and mark your distance again. Did the distance change? Were your paces different distances apart, depending on if you were running or walking? And how much of your foot touched the ground each time? Let us know your favourite dinosaur facts by tagging us on social media at Science at Life.